hi guys welcome again to my page please like and follow this channel subscribe in this channel all on page all i do is talk on celebrity gist trending gist everything that is happening on social media i bring it right here on this page so like and follow so today i bring you update about uh, uh very dark man the fabs and the case between very dark man and uh, falano so yesterday very uh fabs uh, Falano did an interview and uh, it's going viral where he updated and also share his own part of what really happened after sharing it uh, what really got my attention was the part that he said uh, he tried to link up with uh, a phone call to Very Dark Man through Sean Kuti we all know what happened when Very Dark Man came out to play an alleged um, audio about Bob Risky and in that audio Bob Risky alleged calling uh, Falano, Fabs and everybody EFCC and kind of stuff so immediately Fabs debunked it and only say Bob Risky contacted him but he never contacted his father and he told Bob Risky that you have to uh, do it by law I don't have a hand anymore you just that that was how they discussed the whole thing he never gave them bob risky money and bob risky never paid any money to his father so uh and then uh what caught my attention was when um um fabs said he connected with uh Shio Kuti to have a word with very dark man and they connected on phone together like a conference call and they tried to like put it out there and said a guy very dark man what you did is wrong you're supposed to contact me and ask question and that 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 you're not supposed to just do you're supposed to know the truth from me and everything and uh, he said on this interview that is going viral from fab said very dark man was so defensive and said okay you're a lawyer just go to court so that was why they went to court and about the 500 million that people are circulating on social media that the Falano, I mean, the judge um, said to Very Dark Man to pay. That's not true. Fabs, uh, Falano say there was nothing like that. The only thing before the court proceed was telling him to take down all the videos on all his social media platform and do not say anything regarding the Falanos anymore. But uh, Fabs said that up to now, Very Dark Man has not take down the video also the judge also gave him condition to apologize and up to now uh very dark man has not apologized and uh with what fab said yesterday on the interview that very dark man is really ready to go to court like they should go further more and they uh, um they have no choice than to uh do it with him because he's not doing it the right way or a very peaceful way and watching that interview yesterday what uh how fabs uh speak I kind of um, really like the way he, he was speaking. Very gentleman. We all know that Fabs is a very gentleman and he has not even have any ever, any scandal on social media. He's going his way, he's doing his thing. And uh, he has really done well uh, for Nigeria as an activist and also as a celebrity and whatever. So uh, when I watched that interview yesterday, um, the way he talks was so respectful and uh, it was so uh calm and uh, you really need to watch it to the end because it was so polite and respectful and that's how it's supposed to be uh yeah i just hope everything go well and uh, what i am seeing right now very dark man is ready to go to court and i hope he has a lot of evidence uh to back up his claim about the audio because bob risky has come out to say that he doesn't know anything about the audio and he don't he has he didn't pay any money to the falano so um very dark man has to defend where he got that information from and yeah that's the update i said i should bring to you people what do you people think in the comment section writing i i hope they settle out of courts and then um, i'll be bringing more updates on the issue bye